This is a uh, 60 volt, 20 amp hour lithium iron phosphate uh, battery pack. This is actually half of the pack from Ping in China. Um, this pack has been disassembled. That is the, uh, the protective covering, like you see over here, has been taken off of the pack because there is a bad cell in it. The, uh, the bad cell uh, will drain faster than all the other cells. So one or two of these cells is draining faster. And so what I've done is I've drained this pack uh, to the point where the low voltage cutoff uh, in the BMS, which is right over here, there's the BMS, which is set at about 2.1 volts, will kick in and then it'll cut off the entire uh, the output of the, uh, the both the pack. So I'm going to turn on the light right now, which is my drain. So this light is on right now. And I'm going to measure across where the bad cell is, which is right here. Get my polarity right. So you can see it's going down 2.14, 3, 2, 1, 9. And the light just went out and it's going to jump back up to a point at about maybe 2.2. So to give you an idea of the surrounding voltages of the cells, these cells that come in bunches of four, there's uh, five amp hours each, so it's five, 10, 15, 20 amp hours. And um, that's how they're packed in groups of four. Here's a, here's a pack from China that's also packed. And it's a 20 amp power, 3.2 volt, 3.65 volt back pack. So the voltages here are, uh, right, right from the start, um, 3 3.21, 3.18, 2.29, this is where the bad cell is, 3.21, 3.28, Three point two two, three point two three, three point two three, and finally three point two four. So, where the bad cell is, right in here, the voltages are all somewhat low around that area. And I'm going to zoom in a little bit here, and uh, just bring this up a second here. So. The bad cell seems to be either the common cells here. Let's bring this up a little bit so you can see the other terminal. The other, um, the common cells between this terminal and this terminal, where the bad cell is, right, is either this one or this one. These are the common ones between the two. That's my assumption anyway, is that it's either this one or this one. That's Those are the common ones between here and between this point and this point. So it may be there's more, but that's what it looks like to me. It looks like it's either this one here or this one here. So I'm going to unsolder this one here and I'm going to unsolder this one here. And I'm going to take these two cells out, and then I'm going to back this up a bit, unsolder this here, and take two of these cells out and replace them. I'm not sure they only put the uh, the uh, the impedance or the pack the 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 uh, internal resistance here. Uh, up on for every four cells. I don't think they put it on every cell. Just out of curiosity, these these uh, batteries are made by Signal Lab. I don't know if you can see it on here, but you can just barely see it. It says Signal Lab PL60 AS120, 3.2 volts, 500 milliamp hours. So if you're ever wondering where these five amp hour packs come from, from China, they come from Signal Lab, which is the same company that makes the BMS. So, okay, that's all for now, and I'll get you an update when I've uh, done a little bit more.